one. Hey, what's up, dudes? Kublikon here, and welcome back to Dark Souls. And me, personally, I don't really believe in those shoes with the toes and stuff, but have, like, the still, like, normal running bottoms at it. Just not my thing, you know? Just doesn't really do it for me. Um, I've seen people wear them. Well, they're just, you know, kind of... They, some people claim that they're better than all other shoes, but I just didn't feel that way. Oh, my God. My face! There we go. So, I was thinking about going, um... Uh, some ne pyromancy because I mean I am a fire breathing dragon and I think that fits perfectly to have some pyromancy as a fire breathing dragon um, but I've run into a problem and the problem is that you know the guy at Firelink Shrine that sells pyromancies well he was like hey I'm gonna go down to um, uh, the like, Blight Town looking for the, a pyromancer who's supposed to be really skilled. And, um, she and I are, are gonna hang out and she's gonna teach me some cool shit. So, I told him, yeah, go ahead, do it. And then I went down looking for her, and I haven't been able to find this woman. And, um, when I was down there, I found him. But he'd gone hollow and attacked me. And, oh, oh god, arrows. And I was super disappointed, because I was like, oh shit, like, I, uh... He's kind of expecting to learn some fire, you know, from you, big guy. But it didn't happen. And, um, it was super sad, you know? Like, you're all excited for doing something that you've been looking forward to. Add a little flame power to your... Because, I, I mean, this is, all, this is my flame power right now. Which is awesome. And the fact that it, you know, only takes... Um, hold on, I'm going to see if falling flat hurts less. Uh, doesn't seem to hurt any less. Oh, but we're gonna put an eye here, cause why not? <laughs> cause why not? Alright. So I think that that snake guy who fell down last episode and just like hung out, he uh, I think he came from the roof of, or the bridge, kind of thing. Anyway, I was gonna complain about some stuff, which was that I kind of was excited about the pyromancies, and now I'm not sure where I go for pyromancies. I can go to the Daughter of Chaos? You know, the woman you give, um, uh, humanity to, to move up inside of, um, the, uh, the, you know, the thingamajiggy, whatever it's called, for what she wants you to do in the Covenant. But that's the only place that I know that I can get some pyromancies besides what I'm doing. I'm just kind of bummed. Like, I was looking forward to that. I mean, there'll be new game plus, and I bet I can pick some stuff up, like, cheap there. But, I don't know, we'll see. Anyway. Uh, now that I've killed those dudes, I'm gonna just carry on my... Oh, nope, that's not the door. Just gonna carry on my way. We got 16 of these. And, uh, we saw that just dual wield... Or dual wielding. That just using two handed on this sword, striking this guy was pretty epic. He, uh, didn't really have much he could do. Come on. Come on a little closer, buddy. Come on. Yeah! It's good to see you here. So I was reading, um, this one dude's... Ow. This one dude's story when she was talking about his sister playing Dark Souls. And he made this comment about, apparently she was like, anything that can be blocked can be dodged. And I was thinking about it, and I was like, she's right. <laughs> Maybe I'm, uh, I'm relying too much on my shield right now. So, I mean, look at this. But there's a degree of, like, where it's... You feel safe using a shield. And there's, you know, safety... Oh, God. Is really important to have as a character. Ow. Okay. Oh, there it is. Here, I'm going to put my shield up now, for example. So, now, this is a good example of how we could use the shield. Because now, we went and we did our fight. We were dodging the entire time. But we kind of were safe and careful. By, uh, on our, like, what's the word? On our retreat. So we go in. Okay. Ow, oh, that hit me direct. Dodge through it. Forward once. 
Dodge again. Dodge again. Strike. Oh, come on. Uh-oh. Oh, come on. Drink. Move. Oh, God. Dodge. Dodge. Ow. There it is. All right. Give me some of that Demon Titanite. Yeah. All right, you're next, big guy. And uh, I feel a lot more comfortable when I can kind of take my own time. Especially with the, the spear, you know, is the ultimate, like, not what that girl was talking about weapon. Because you can stab around the shield. Uh-oh, too early. Let's drink that. We're going to switch back to the uh, Chaos Blade. Shield up. Come on. Come on. There we got him. Roll. Oh, come on. Strike. Strike. Two-handed. Nice. Move. Oh, come on. Roll. Oh, God. Roll. Strike. 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 I couldn't roll because I was out of stamina. Alright, shield up. Back. Right, goes for a second couple of swings. And apparently he can reach me. Ah, damn it. Forward roll. Strike. Alright, we're going well. We only have two Estus flasks after 20, but still. <laughs> Come on. Forward. Ow. Strike. 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 Oh, I can't just tank through that right now. All right, well, one more Estus Flask. Roll, there it is. Strike, strike, strike. One more hit, there it is. Whoo! What a joy to be able to get through that. Oh, man, and we have it almost enough to level up, which is pretty cool. Uh, plus, we have enough to bring ourselves back to human again, which will be nice. What is back here? I've never gone this far back before. Oh, there's like a thing up there, too. Is there a way for me to get it down? Is there like someone I can save in here? Yeah, I've never been back here in this game before. This is interesting. Huh. God, it's all gloopy. So, I'm guessing that there's a lot more in this fortress that I've yet to really explore. I was watching a video and people were talking to a character named Big Hat Logan and uh, I've never met him but it looked like they were talking to him here and I bet he's in one of those cages that's that's my hunch but if he I mean so that would be kind of fun to you know meet another character that I've never had the chance to meet oh man look at this slow uh, through the goop oh that guy fell down yep there <laughs> There's the guy. Oh, wow. They're shooting the lightning at me already. There we go. Oh, we made it through. Okay. So the next step will be going back to the giant's tomb. And then after we go back to the giant's tomb, we can go back to um, uh, the drake to see if the drake is there at all. And uh, I want to be human because I kind of want to allow people to invade me if they wish to. Um, I, what is cool about the dragon is eyes that you can technically invade people without doing that. But, uh, oh, dead snakes. What's up, dead snakes? Woo! Oh, try dashing through. Oh, that jerk. He's just run you straight into the friggin' blade. It's like, oh yeah, try dashing through. Be wary of lightning. Bloop. Good luck, thank you. Oh, man. And yoink. Grab this. We're not exactly ready to level up yet. We're very close. Uh, we need like 24,000 or something. Oh wow, that guy had a cool helmet with like the fan on his head. I like that. There we go. Let's see what level up is. Oh, we need 25 now. Wow. Jeez. All right. Uh, warp to. Well, let's see if uh, there... he's at the sunlight altar again. Or right, dude that we love so much. And I guess maybe it would make sense to keep my soft humanity. I don't know. I like in being able to invade people, but I haven't felt like I've been able to get it to work consistently. Ooh, 
titanite shard. Not that I really use those anymore, but hey, ooh. Is this, is he just not? Ow. Oh, there it is! Wow! I wonder what took him so long. Hey! Uh-oh. Okay. I'm, I'm like you, big guy. Bloop. There we go. I wonder what took him so long. There, I had something special in mind for this guy, too. Uh, poisons. Yes. Poison arrows. I want to use my poison arrows. Hey! You wet it? I don't know if I'll be able to hit him right there. Hey! There's some poison arrow! Yeah! Oh-ho-ho! -ho. Oh-ho! I'm excited now! Okay! Uh, that attack is pretty damaging. As is the return attack. Ow! Okay. So, his little fire dash I can't really do much about, but I can duck from. There's not much he can do about me hitting with light er, with poison arrows. Hmm. Oh, he apparently can spit fire into my face. Jeez. Alright. Oh, there he is. Oh, I'm excited. It took me a long time to get to this point, though, honestly. Like... Where'd he go? Whoop! Oh, God damn it! We can like really tank these attacks, but got him! Oh, I was under here, like significantly under here. Wow! This is this is damaging. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Back it up a bit. I wonder if I get Gao's, like, or the Dragon Slayer bow and tried using that. Here we go, here we go. Oh, oh! One hit! Wow! Okay! That was insane! Alright, um... Alright! Wow! One hit! My face! Uh, it's all about the Rorschach jokes. Jeez. Okay, um... So he definitely shows up. <laughs> we got that part figured out. Woo! So he leaves first thing now that I showed up there. Alright. So he just, he's out now? Like... It's not random, but it's kind of, ow. It's not random, but it's just kind of like, at his own whim? I guess? Dragon! Oh yeah, nice, here's my power. Cover lost power, nice. Jack, dragon? Dragon! Dragon! Oh crap, okay. Huh. So it's just, just like that. He's in and he's out. Maybe, hold on, maybe if I do this, he'll respawn. So they all respawn. So they the dragon come back at all? Doesn't seem to be here anywhere. Oh man, epicosity! Hold on. Ah! <laughs> I did I announce my presence enough with my breathing fire? 
Man, that dragon breathing the fire, or the drake breathing fire straight on our heads. Holy crap. There wasn't anything we could do about that. Well, I feel like, hold on. Soon. Oh, <laughs> I have my spear going through the wall. Bloop. Oh, here's something I've always thought was funny. Whenever I switch hands, the weapon, like, shrinks a little bit. Like, it becomes smaller as I'm putting it away. And it's actually not as easy to see with this, but it's like... Alright, so he doesn't seem to be coming from this way anymore. Well, damn. Kind of disappointed about that. Ugh. But he definitely kicked her butts. Like, easy. Alright then. Uh, well, dudes, if you uh, liked what you saw, please leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And of course, may the ground rise to meet your feet. May the window always be at your back. And may the sun shine warmly in your sexy sex face. Dudes, see you later. Ah!